Tinubu's alleged conspiracy to oust Rivers Governor Fubara sparks outrage. Hello everyone, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or depending on the time we're reaching you guys. Welcome back to our channel. Yes, guys, we're well, back again with latest and most authentic happenings in the country. Um, in the last couple of weeks, uh, we've uh, um, come across reports uh, regarding Wiki and um, Fubara's um, war. They are fighting war of words and um, even Bola Tinubu, the president, being dragged into all of this. Um, Fubara and um, his supporters alleging that um, um, Bola Tinubu has a hand in this and um, it's, um, it's a sort of support he's giving to Wiki that is um, making Wiki stronger or giving him um, the strength to pursue all of the things he's pursuing. You know, recently a court, um, the Federal High Court in Abuja, um, instructed the Central Bank of Nigeria or stopped the Central Bank of Nigeria from um, allocating, releasing funds to River State. And um, Fubara believes that um, all of this is the handiwork of Yeson Wiki with their intervention. Even yesterday, Fubara said it, that uh, is the intervention of uh, Bola Tinubu. If not, that Bola Tinubu um, intervened to help his enemies. He didn't call names, but we know um, who he's referring to. Uh, both of them, the name calling has been ongoing with Wiki calling Fubara a snake. And right now, Fubara referring to uh, Yeson Wiki as the enemy. Uh, what is going on right now is that um, even Fubara and um, his camp, they believe that um, the plot by Wiki and um, um, everything going on is not just regarding um, the fonts of the state, but it's actually to um, unseat him. And we've received reports also in the last couple of days from the Niger Delta um, group as well, stating that um, if Fubara is removed, if Wiki eventually succeeds and Fubara is removed from um, um, being the governor of the state, that uh, <laughs> they are not going to take it lightly, that they believe nothing will happen, but they will see what, is hap what will happen. But the surprising thing here is right now, it's um, um, the fact that uh, um, um, Tinubu has a hand in this. Is very shocking. You know, it recently, or it's not even recently, from the general election, from the general election last year, we saw that um, Wiki has um, pledged uh, unwavering support to Bola Tinubu, even reaffirming it. Um, not so. These these are not allegations. Which you know, normally sometimes we hear allegations that um, um, he's supporting this person or he's supporting that, but he has said it with his mouth that he doesn't regret supporting Bola Tinubu for presidency and that he will do it again and again this is quite interesting so um tinubu's alleged conspiracy to ask rivers governor fubara sparks outrage a lot of uh, um stakeholders and supporters of um, fubara they've been saying a lot of things and this one right now is coming from um the former deputy national publicity secretary of the all progressive congress apc comrade timmy frank is accusing um bola tinubu We'll bring all of the details uh, in a moment, but before we do, guys, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, click on the like button. If it's your first time here, you're very welcome. Please click on the subscribe button. God bless you. Now into the details of the reports. Former Deputy National Publicity Secretary of the All Progressive Congress, APC, Comrade Timmy Frank, has accused President Bola Tinubu of masterminding a conspiracy to oust River State Governor Simina Laie Fubara. Frank's claims comes on the heels of a recent federal high court ruling that seized the state's monthly allocation, which he labeled a part of a sinister scheme aimed at either forcing Fubara to join the APC or removing him from the office entirely. This is why the president has remained mute despite the gross violation of constitution by the courts and police in River State, Frank stated suggesting that Tinubu's dissatisfaction arises from Fubara's refusal to align with the APC. He alleged that former Governor Yesom Wiki had warned Tinubu that Fubara's governance could threaten his 2027 presidential ambition. Frank further asserted that all security agencies and federal institutions are working against Fubara warning they have been directed to ensure that Fubara succumbs to the president's wishes. 
He cautioned that any effort to destabilize River State would meet significant resistance from its populace. Calling for immediate action, Frank urged the international community to intervene, saying a stitch in time saves nine. Let the international community step in now before the crisis boils over. He stressed that any harm to Fubara or the states could disrupt the operation of international oil companies in the Niger Delta, adding, the people are solidly behind him. For that of the, um, the oil companies, you know, when Niger Delta militant group spoke, when they um, expressed their own concerns, uh, they stated that um, if Fubara is removed as governor, that um, <laughs> they are going to destroy um, all of um, the oil wells and um, they are going to disrupt um, the uh, oil activities in the states. They, and they've said that this is not just um, uh, ordinary threats. But um, interestingly, we know that Ebola Tinubu has not said anything, and that is what is um, even raising um, more worries, that his silence in all of this goes a long way to show that um, he's um, involved in what is going on. Umina uh, uh, Fubara is uh, of the People's Democratic Party. He won the ticket under the People's Democratic Party. Wike himself, they are both of the same party, but Wike has recently um, been in support of the APC, claiming that um, uh, Bola Tinubu's administration has been very successful and he can see, he can see the light <laughs> out of the tunnel. While Frank um, is alleging right now, it's another dimension. This is a new twist. And Frank is stating that it's because they want to force uh, Fumbara to... Uh, <laughs> to join the APC. That is common with them, switching, crisscrossing from one party to another. And that uh, it's been mentioned previously, that Wiki has previously mentioned to Tinubu that um, Fubara is going to hinder his 2027 presidential ambition. That is why all of this. But we know um, Tinubu has not done anything directly but um, uh, um, to Fumbara, but what can be seen, the handwritings can be seen, you know, from the court ruling, it was alleged that um, Tinubu influenced the judges that is influenced um, on the case. That was why um, the allocations of the funds were stopped. That if not that Tinubu intervened, his enemies wouldn't have won the court case. The presidency, they are quick to respond anytime anything is mentioned um, regarding Tinubu or um, his government. But this is not the first time um, Tinubu is being dragged into this um, the, the war between um, um, Fumbara and um, Wiki. We don't know if he will say anything now. Well, guys, leave us your take. Thank you once again for staying tuned. Please don't forget to like, share, and to subscribe. Till I come your way again with more updates. Bye for now.